Hello everyone and welcome to Stream Attack Now. Hope everyone's doing well. The number one question I get asked is can we use a mouse toggle on the new Google Chromecast with Google TV? And the answer is yes. Take a look at the TV and as you can see, I've got a mouse toggle navigated. And guess what guys? I'm actually using the Google Chromecast remote to navigate it. Look at that. Now there is a trick and there is a caveat and I'm going to explain what that is in just a second. Now this is for people that do not have a USB hub. You don't need a USB hub in order to do this method. But obviously if you can, if you have a USB hub you can use an air mouse and that's going to be much easier. You can also use a regular Bluetooth mouse to control, um, you can pair a regular one if you have a Bluetooth USB hub. But in this video, I'm gonna show you a way you can actually use the Fire Stick remote that will help you use the mouse toggle. Okay, so the secret of this is you really need to have like an older Fire Stick remote. I know a lot of people that have this Chromecast are, you know, upgrading from a Fire Stick and they probably have an older remote lying around. Um, I've tried a couple other ones. Some remotes will work and some won't, but it really needs to be a Bluetooth type remote um, in order to pair it. Now, some of them didn't, um, didn't work for me. Like I tried the Buzz TV, that did not work. Um, so the Fire Stick remotes work really well and it has the ability to activate the mouse toggle because it has that pause and play button. And that's what you need right now in order to turn the mouse toggle on. So I'm going to go ahead and activate the mouse toggle. This is just an older Fire Stick remote that I had laying around. And so as you can see, I've got it activated so I can actually use my Fire Stick remote and it actually works great. Um, with this. So if I turn it off, as you can see, I can navigate all of the buttons and everything. And one thing that's really nice is going into file link, for example, um, I can go ahead and use the fast forward and the rewind button to go ahead and skip categories just like that. As you can see, it's so much faster. I cannot do that with the Google Chromecast remote. So this is much better when navigating file link store. So I'm going to go back to the home screen. And as you can see, I'm using this Fire Stick remote to navigate everything right now. But let me go ahead and activate the mouse toggle. So I just activated it and now that I have it activated, now I can go ahead and take my Chromecast remote and it will allow me to navigate with this, okay? But if you have a Fire Stick remote, you might as well use that um, because it is a little bit easier to navigate, but I did want to show you that you still can use the Google Chrome cache remote to navigate it. So let me show you how to quickly get it paired, and it's really easy. All right, so in order to get this paired, it's really easy. And by the way, I do want to give a shout out to Tech Doctor UK. I actually got the idea of being able to use the Fire Stick remote from him. Definitely want to give him credit. Definitely go check out his channel, Tech Doctor UK. He has amazing videos, one of my absolute favorite YouTubers. Definitely go subscribe to his channel. So go ahead and go to settings. And then once in settings, you're going to want to head down right to remotes and accessories. Go ahead and click that. And then just simply click on pair remotes. Just click that. And as soon as you do that, you got to hit the home button on your Fire Stick remote. Hit that home button and hold it there for like three seconds. And then it's going to pop up right in the top right hand corner, as you can see. And once it does that, you just basically click on it and then it's going to go through the pairing process. And sometimes it takes, you know, maybe 10, 15 seconds or so. And then it's going to give you this message right here. So we're going to go ahead and click on pair. And there it says, now it says paired at the very top. And that's what you want to see. And as you can see right there, it says Amazon Fire TV remote. And so that's what you want. And so now I can go ahead and take out my Amazon TV remote right here. And I can literally just go ahead and navigate and go through all of the motions that I want right here. All right. So once you have your Fire Stick paired, then we need to go ahead and just get the mouse toggle app. And it's really easy. It's right in the Google Play Store. So just go to the Google Play Store. 
and then search for mouse toggle. Just go up to the top to the magnifying glass and then just say mouse toggle. And it will pull it right up. Right there it is. So go ahead and download that. It's free and open it up. And once you open it up, it's going to give you this message right here. And we can go ahead and just click OK. And then as you can see, there's some red writing there. And it says disabled. Please select open system button and enable the mouse toggle settings. So all we need to do is just go into the system settings. And so let's do that. And once in settings, then what you want to do is go down to system. And then once in system, go to accessibility. And then once in accessibility, just scroll down and you will see mouse toggle right there. Now it's going to say off, but just click it and then click it again and it will click it will give you this message so go ahead and click ok and then that will turn it to blue that means it's enabled and it's on and then you are good to go so if we click the home button bring back bring you back to the home screen let's take our fire stick remote and activate the mouse toggle by clicking the the play pause button twice and there you go as you can see we've got the mouse toggle activated and we are all set. So that's how you do it on a Google Chromecast with Google TV. Let me know in the comments if this helps you out. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see you next time on Streaming Tech Now.